This man has done the father of the nation proud. Kusuma Rajaya has just won the patent for producing silk without killing silkworms. Rajaya wants to call it Ahimsa silk. But the patent office says the word Ahimsa cannot be patented. So they call it an eco-friendly method of manufacturing mulberry silk yarn. My inspiration is uh, Mahatma. He given a message to the Indian silk industry. If the silk is being produced without killing the uh, silk worm, that would be better. So uh, that uh, he dreamt, but in his life it is not to happen. Uh, and uh, I am the happiest person to at least I could able to do a little thing. Mr. Rajaya says he started giving a serious thought to Ahimsa Silk when in the 90s Mrs. Janaki Venkatraman, wife of the former president, asked if she could get a silk sari that was made without killing silk worms. Then, when animal rights activist and former actress Amala Akineni refused a silk dress because she did not want to be wearing anything that involved violence against animals, Mr. Rajaya decided it was time to make his Ahimsa silk fabric. Yarn for a silk sari is usually produced by throwing live cocoons of silkworm into boiling water. A single sari needs up to 50,000 cocoons. Unlike others, Rajaya allows not to escape from the cocoon by waiting for 7 to 10 days and then uses the shells to produce yarn. The same weight sari is costing around 2,500 in normal silk with the same ornamentation. Whereas this is costs for about 4000 rupees maybe one and a half times because here one thing we should know we are saving about 50000 lives the ahimsa silk fabric has reached the wardrobe of famous names sonia gandhi maneka gandhi sheila dikshit former indonesian president megawati sukarnoputri this young woman from the us ordered it not just for her bridal dress but for all her bridesmaids as well in hyderabad uma sudhir ndtv नब्बे के दशक में भूतपूर्व राष्ट्रपति की पत्नी जाने की वेंकटरामन ने पूछा कि क्या आप सिल्क वर्म को मारे बिना सिल्क साड़ी तैयार कर सकते हैं तब से राजैया इस काम पर जुट गए